The social media queen, or at least was the social media queen Kim Kardashian, has recently found herself in the middle of a social media crisis. In a shocking turn of events, she has lost a staggering 1 million followers on Instagram, leaving her and her team scared for the worst to happen to her career as a social media influencer and entrepreneur. When we hate on them, they make money. When we praise them, they make money. But when we block their social media accounts and completely forget their names, they lose it all. It's working. It's working, guys. Kim K just lost 3 million of her followers. Keep doing it. Keep going, it, guys. TikTok users are calling for a mass block on celebrities who aren't using their platforms to speak up about social issues, mainly Israel's months-long war on Palestine's Gaza. Well, fam, buckle up for this because it's a doozy with Kim Kardashian losing the title she has held for as long as we can remember. Is she finally losing her career? Are fans finally canceling her for good? First assignment, meaning the first celebrity that we're going to mass block until they speak up in support of Palestine is Kim Kardashian. Because it looks like it. So alarm bells are ringing as a massive backlash against celebrities gains momentum on TikTok where hashtags like blockout 2024 are spreading like wildfire and thousands of users are jumping on the trend. However, although there are many celebrities under this widespread bandwagon of cancelling and blocking celebrities, Kim Kardashian appears to be on top of every list and people have interesting reasons as to why they no longer want these celebrities to hold the places they used to hold in the industry or influence them as they used to. Block. Block all their sources of revenue because I was blocking people and then getting ads for their businesses that I've never seen before in my life. So check all the boxes. The main motive to block Kim Kardashian and the rest of the celebrities is to stop the ad revenue they receive because fans believe that they made them famous through their attention and time spent watching them and believe that together they can as well remove them from the places they put them. But why are people so into cancelling these celebrities, especially Kim Kardashian that they have always wanted to cancel for a long time? Just a quick reminder that us blocking all the celebrity it is working because i just said that kim trash last three millions three millions followers it is working so apparently fans have finally come to a realization that celebrities do not care about them or the world today and what's happening in it despite having all the power to change something about it. This amount of rage took an instant build-up after the Met Gala took place recently, with the fans not happy of how they are spending a staggering $75,000 on a mere ticket to the glamorous event when people are starving and millions and millions of Palestinians being displaced in Gaza and several others dying and they're not doing anything about it. It. Kim Kardashian in particular was heavily blasted on the internet when she recently made a comment that provoked people. The reality TV star's recent appearance at the OMR Business Festival in Hamburg to talk about the success of her scheme's business quickly took a turn for the worst when a pro-Palestine protester stormed the room asking to free Palestine and was given an answer from Kim Kardashian that many people hated her for and said that she doesn't care about the genocide that's happening in Gaza. Some TikTokers are sharing their list of celebrities to block in an effort to hold them accountable for their silence and push them to use their platforms to speak up about the atrocities happening in Gaza. But wait, there's more shocking revelations that followed. The mother of four and businesswoman replied to the protester telling them that everyone needs to be free, that it's not just Palestine alone that needs the freedom. After saying that, she tried to express that she supports every single life out there, but people were convinced that she is pro-Israel and supports the massacre that is happening in Gaza. 
people pointed out that freedom and quality are not equally distributed and that some group like Palestinian people face systemic oppression and marginalization. When you block their content, they start pushing you their ads. Like they're really digging for that engagement, which means that the block party is working. So join the block party and block celebrities and influencers that have not spoken out against the genocide. Kim Kardashian's reputation took a hit, being accused of being tone deaf and using her platforms only for self-promotion instead of raising fair awareness on important issues going on in the world. However, when it comes to Kim Kardashian, this new trend finds her on the trip of being cancelled already as she had also been recently humiliated in public. The businesswoman recently attended Tom Brady's greatest roast of all time, where she was received with a large amount of hostility from the fans booing her for more than a whole minute. But as if that wasn't enough, she also went ahead and said some things that people didn't like, like mentioning how she became famous for leaking her sex tape with Ray J and the fact that her father defended the infamous OJ Simpson in the court of law. The day wasn't over for the reality TV star because even her fellow celebrities went ahead and expressed their disapproval of her, like Tony Hinchcliffe, who apparently told her to close her legs because she's had so many black men celebrating her end zone already. For booing her, at one point you could see that she was getting a little bit frustrated, a little bit flustered. I don't know how she did it, I don't know how she pulled through, because if that was me, I would have been bawling, I would have been crying. So at this point, Kim is not only being hated by her fans, but also fellow celebrities, but particularly for the boost she received, it is believed that they initially stemmed from the beef that she has with singer Taylor Swift, who recently branded her the infamous Amy on her song Thank You Amy. This song brought a new layer of fans and mozzity towards Kim Kardashian because of how it highlighted how she is a bully and all the terrible things she did for the singer during their public beef which started in 2019. This song in particular made Kim Kardashian lose more than 200,000 followers on Instagram and with this new trend it looks like people are determined to cancel her for good. Now I think that this looks super bad for Kim Kardashian because as a person who is a social media influencer and almost all her income and businesses based on her social media popularity this looks bad for her because it leaves her with the risk of losing her status in the pop culture. That's not all, because this trend also comes right before season 5 of their reality TV show drops this month, and this might also promise a very bad reception of their new season because people no longer want to watch her or hear what she has to say. I hope everyone can see what is happening with the Blockout 2024 initiative and see that this is the most easy thing that anyone on this app has ever asked anyone to do in the name of the greater good. Anyways guys, tell me what you think of this trend that's taking over the internet. Do you think people are justified in blaming these celebrities for not doing anything about what's going on in the world? Let me know what you think and don't forget to like and subscribe to keep updated.